Go to officialharshtwins.com and pick you out a patriotic t-shirt today. Hell, I'm even giving you 20% off. Just type in discount code Chinese virus. We call it Chinese because it's from China. We making t-shirts great again. Yeah. Yeah. Tired of this email. I showed my girlfriend's nude to a friend. You sound like a good friend, man. Yeah, man. I got some friends, man. They don't show me their girlfriend's nude, man. They ain't no good friends, man. I want a friend like you. <laughs> you sound like a real good friend. You sound like the type of friend let me watch. You Hold sound on. like a good friend, man. You sound like the type of friend, man. You might even let me have a piece. Content expired. What's this all about? What are you doing? It says the content expired. He sent me an email and the damn email expired. What kind of... Here we go. Get up off me. A while back when I wasn't as smart and thoughtful as I am now... Well, yeah, you real thoughtful now. You good dude, man. When I was one of... When I was with one of my closest dude friends, I showed my girlfriend's boob pic. Oh, man, it's hot. Now, mind hey, you... Hey, did he send any boob pics? He ain't sitting there. I, I guess that's what he sent me. It expired. Man, you crazy as hell. I showed my girlfriend's boob pic. Now... What the hell you comb your damn beard for in the video? Get some of that damn good, clean beard action. All that damn scratch. <laughs> I showed my girlfriend's boot. So he pic. sent the picture, but he had it set to expire so we could jerk off to it. I don't know, see? Yeah, he didn't want you jerking off to it. Look here. Don't sound like a good friend to me. I showed my girlfriend's boot pic. Now, mind you, I did not send it. I only showed it in person, and it was once. About a year later. Well, that's okay. You didn't send it to him. Yeah. You showed it to him on your phone. See, if you would have sent it to him, that's reckless. That's, that's Once they get online, yeah. it's over. Yeah, you took some precautions. Hey, just, hey, hey, look. You can see it from my phone. Yeah, look. See? Look at it. It's nice, ain't it? Look at it. Now respect it. I'm going to suck on it tonight. <laughs> it came to my mind, and it just felt completely guilty and shameful about it because I disrespected her trust. How do I cope with this guilt without her knowing? Man, you crazy as hell. Man. The only person to know about is you and your sleazy friend. <laughs> <laughs> just learn from it and move on with your life. Yeah. What don't do, you... do it again. If it makes you feel that bad, just don't do it again. Go buy some roses, take her out to eat, but don't you ever... Tell that damn girl what you just did. Yeah. I mean, because that's unforgivable. See, what you did, what you participated in, that's just like, that's just the dude thing you did. The reason why you did it is because your dude's like, look, I'm proud of this. This is mine. Hey, look at this. You know what I'm saying? That's why you did it. It's like when you get with a girl, like, first time you had sex, first time, first you stuck some fingers in there. You would then watch that hand forever. When you see your friends say, hey, look, hey, smell this. Because you're proud of yourself. Proud of your girl. That's why you did it. It's just a dude, just a very dudely, misogynistic type of thing to do. <laughs> if you're just a dude. See, girls if you, don't. If you feel bad about it, just, hey, just move on with your life, man. Yeah, don't do it again. Yeah, girls don't understand it. It's just it's a dude thing, man. You got to be a dude to understand that. Yeah, dudes, we just we just, we just, just built differently from girls. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Girls all emotional. Oh, baby, I love you. You got me flowers. Won't you ever give me flowers? Let's go to a movie and a picnic. Man, shut the hell up. Get us a picnic basket. Now dudes be like, yeah, look at this. Got Smell up. this. Yeah, that's her. Look, baby, we got your large pepperoni pizza. That picnic. That's how you cope with that. Don't just do it again. Just move on with your life. Don't tell her. If you do, you're 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 an idiot. Before you go, go to harshtwins.tv. It's only two ninety nine a month. It's damn near free. Who ain't got ten cents a day? I know you got it. It's a couple of nickels. It's ah. a nickel and five pennies. It's ten pennies. Who ain't got that? I want my money. Start the show. Got a damn good show for y'all today. Good show. Title of this email. She only dated black guys. <laughs> Has they had sex with her yet? 
I don't know. Can I read the email? Well, read it then. You take too damn long. I'm well, going to start reading the emails. I'm, and not like guys like y'all, but dark-skinned blacks, which is fine. But how can you be attracted? I guess we okay. But yeah. What kind of black guys? Light skin? Okay. Like harsh twins? Okay, I can deal with that. Hey, Kev, you keep telling me to read the email. I can't I fool s- with you if you mess with these dark That's hey. what he's thinking. Man, you combing your damn beard in the video. Damn, you have some you, damn man. respect. You got an attitude last couple days, No, man, man. we on set, man. We're supposed to be brushing your damn beard on set. Trying well, to get this beard to grow. Her oral is maddening. What is that, blowjob? Oral, yeah. Yeah, you know why? Them n****s how to suck dick. No, you're sucking it wrong, girl. Slow down on that suck it. <laughs> now hold these big-ass nuts in your hand. <laughs> I'm a good size six inches. Six inches? Compared to n- I'm a good size. That's, that's, uh, that's, man. Man, you crazy as hell. I remember I had this I got friend. a good solid six inches on me. I remember I was in the Marine Corps. This is tall black dude. What was his name? I think it's, you Keith. Was it's Keith. His name was Keith, just like me, right? So we had to go to the bathroom. We go to the bathroom. We go to the ur- urinal, right? And he's in front of me. He pulls his dick out. That shit falls down to the fucking floor. <laughs> his dick ain't even hard. I said, Keith, what the f is that? Hey, that was crazy. I was like, how the f*** you p-? And when he was pissing, he was like five feet from the fucking urinal, and the damn dick was still in the urinal. <laughs>